Hi Jurassic Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw a rainbow alpaca, so let's get started. To draw this cute alpaca, we're going to first start by drawing two strands of hair on top of its head. So I'm going to come right here, just draw two little curves, one longer and one shorter. And then we're going to start to draw the top of its head. So just come down with a curve. And now we're just going to bring this down. On both sides. So we're going to slowly build our packa's head, the shape, and we're going to angle out a tiny bit more. And let's see here. Keep coming down, and then from about right there, I'm going to angle it in a little bit. Just kind of start to bring it in. And now that we're pretty much even, <laughs> it looks like a, like a girl's hair, right? <laughs> okay, so then from there, we're going to start to um, draw a bunch of little curves to connect it. So let's start. And I'm just going to go up and down, sometimes bigger, sometimes um, smaller with our curves. And let's just go ahead and connect it. There, <laughs> super cute already, right? <laughs> okay, so then from there, let's come to the side right here where we draw the ears. So about, say, in this area right here, let's come out, a curve, round off the tip, and come down. And then come in here, we're just going to draw a curve. So let's do the same thing on the other side. So we're just going to drag some points across. So I know approximately where the other ear is going to sit. So from right there, once again, just like the other side, curve up the tip and bring it back down to your point. And come in here once again with a curve. Okay, now let's bring this alpaca to life. We're going to come in this area where it kind of dips in. In the center right here, we're going to draw um, an oval. So I'm going to come about right here. And I'm going to start my oval. And connect it. There. And then let's come inside this oval and we're going to draw, let's see here, I'm going to draw in the center. I'm going to give myself a point. Go up, widen out V. And I'll go ahead and connect it very lightly. And then I'm going to bring a straight line down. And from there, I'm going to go out with a curve on both sides. And cap it off. And then let's come to the side right here. We're going to draw a circle. So let's come about right here. And we're going to draw a circle out all the way back. And come in here and draw another circle right next to it inside. And it's the same thing on the other side. So about right here. And we're going to go up. And come back. And once again, the same thing. Just draw a circle inside. Okay, so then now I am going to try to make this a draw so cute eye. <laughs> I'm going to add two small circles in here for highlights and a curved line at the bottom. There, I did it. And then two lines at the bottom. So same thing over here. There. Okay, so then from there, let's come and start to draw the body. So I'm going to come, I'm going to center the body, so say about right here. Give myself two points, and we're going to bring down a slight angle line. And just keep bringing it down. About right there, I'm going to start to bring it in. Gonna start to curve it in 
and about right there. I'm going to come to the center now that these two points are pretty much even. I'll come to the center about right here. And once again, I'm just going to draw some curves right in the center. And I'm going to bring out a longer one. And then I'm going to go ahead and connect it. So all the way back. And same thing over here. There. And then let's come in here. I'm just going to finish off this curve. And let's draw the, um, the leg part right here. So this area towards the edge on this side. I'm going to draw a curve. And another curve. And connect it. So the same thing over here. So towards the edge on this side, I'm just going to make sure I'm at the same level. About the same width. And connect. And then instead of making it look like um, it's just on two stilts, let's come in here and we're going to kind of have an indication of some back legs. So right here, just tuck in. Okay, so then now let's add a bunch of curves uh, like a stripe to make it a rainbow alpaca. So I'm going to come right here for our first layer, about right here, and I'm going to go across to here. So I'll just give myself a point so I know where I'm aiming towards. And I'm just going to go curve all the way across. And um, I'll do another layer right here where the eyes are. So about right here. Just make it easier. Separate it right there. Okay, and then now for the body. So I'll start say about right here. I'll go to first layer. And I'm gonna go across so I know where I'm heading. And once again, Back of our little curves here and there. And let's see here. Go with another layer about right here. So once again, heading toward this area. And I'm going to add two different ones right here. So I'm going to come down about right here. Kind of like a little pocket. I think it makes it look cuter. I'm going to draw two curves. So I'm going to give it some color. And I'm just going to finish this all the way through. There. And of course, I'm going to have to add a heart right here. <laughs> and make it my dress. So cute alpaca. So, and then let's come up here. I'm just going to add a little curve on top. I forgot that. For the eyes and that is pretty much it for this cute little alpaca so then now that we're done with the drawing let's go ahead and color it
So there, hope you love how this rainbow alpaca turned out and it inspires you to give it a try. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please give me a thumbs up and share it so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.